This is the newest Stormweaver boss, and this is the reworked Ceaseless Void, and this is Cygnus. The massive Infernum update just dropped, so for today's video, we'll be showcasing all the new reworked Sentinel battles. First, beginning with the Ceaseless Void. With the goal to have a more defined presence outside of their boss fights, this can be shown in the boss being locked away in the Forsaken Archive. You won't be able to damage or interact with it without the Rune of Cos, which will warp your background and begin the fight. Compared to the regular Ceaseless Void fight, this one feels way better to verse. Yes, it is definitely more difficult, but the unique array of attacks make it more exciting to challenge. These attack patterns can range from Elder Rich Blast, the Charge Up attacks, and the Ball Spam. Now, when you get it low on HP, it will actually break free from the chains and fire various telegraph lasers at you. This requires some precise movement, and the concept of teleporting around definitely requires some brain power in order to successfully dodge. And finally, it's desperation attempt to try to kill you. When it reaches 1 HP, the Ceases Void will fire a barrage of dark energy, which just looks amazing. Overall, the various curved projectiles throughout this fight make it the most difficult sentinel for me personally. Now let's move on to the Cygnus rework. Compared to the Ceaseless Void being locked away in the dungeon, Cygnus on rare occasions will patrol hell, casually walking by, and if you visit the Profane Garden, you can see him just chilling there. Now, I don't think Cygnus got entirely new attacks, however, one thing you immediately notice is the amazing new Void Purple background, which just helps to create a more immersive Calamity experience. Similarly to Calamity, Infernum Cygnus is very fast paced and requires some quick movement. However, with that being said, of course there'll be some crazy projectile spam. One attack I find super satisfying is this one in which your screen will dim as these shadow slashes will chase you. That's really worth to say about this boss. In my opinion, he's the easiest sentinel, but still very fun to fight. It's time for the final sentinel, the Stormweaver. And just let me show you this first. The Stormweaver may randomly appear and just feast on mobs before running away. Like how epic is that? Anyways, let's talk about the actual fight now. His phase 1 is relatively tame, not really dashing at the player much, however, casting the lightning bolts and other storm projectiles at you. But this does all change in phase 2 at 50% HP, where he gains this new portal jump ability, very similar to the Devourer of Gods, where he will swiftly dash at you whilst releasing more bolts around him. This is a pretty satisfying attack to dodge, and you gotta admire the visual effects on all these bosses. So that's all I wanted to show you for this video. Infernum is now out, have fun!